Hey up Chatter Chatter Gang, Gang. it's dinner time again in Benidorm, Chatter Gang, and uh, tonight we're going to the second highest rating restaurant in Benidorm, because we couldn't get a table at the highest rated one. No, and we're uh, eating at the dining room. And we want you to come with us, because he's Colin, he's Tim, and and together together we are the Chatter Guys. guys. Come on, let's get noshing. (laughs) Tim, can you tell the chatter gang what your first impressions are of the dining room? Oh, it's a lovely restaurant, very elegant. Uh, all the walls are painted black, which makes all the furniture and uh, the ornaments look uh, really rich. Um, there is a lady on the table behind me, and it's her free birthday dinner. And the reason I know this is. She's got a very, very loud voice. Hopefully, we'll bring a recording of it for you. What are your first impressions, Colin? Well, the decor, like you said, in Tim, the decor, they put a lot of effort into the decor. It's uh, black, but it's not too dark. It's very chic and uh, the ambience, it creates the ambience of the uh, establishment. I must say the wait for us. Oh my God, knock out. She's doing absolutely. As soon as she saw us come over, all the life, really, I don't know where she's from, but she is worth her weight in gold in this place. Tim, you've picked the wine for us. Yes. I've had a taste and it's beautiful, thank you. <laughs> do you we, we never get a bad bottle of wine, do we, when we're in Benidorm? It's always really nice. We've gone with some uh, Cabernet Sauvignon, and um, yeah, I agree with you, it's lovely. But we've never been disappointed with wine. I'm not going to get to Colin, your bruschetta was massive, wasn't it? Did it beat you? Uh, it did. I've not eaten all the salad. I like salad, but in proportions. However, the tomatoes were really nice. Goat's cheese, I don't know whether I've had goat's cheese before, so that was something new. But the sauce is what were in that, and the caramelised fig, it all worked together. It was just mouth-watering and beautiful. And look at my prawn cocktail. Wow. Brown bread buttered for me. Prawns have been dressed. I hate it when you put a prawn with its shell on the top. That looks delicious. Tim, you've cleaned your plate. I have. Can I ask, what the prawns rubbery? <laughs> Not one rubbery prawn, Colin. They were all delicious. Nice, big, juicy prawns. Nicely dressed. The marrow roast sauce, lovely and thick. Uh, yeah, just spot on. My favourite starter, and I'm glad I ordered it again. When it said black spaghetti, I wasn't expecting black spaghetti. No? Wow. Colin, did you like your black spaghetti? I didn't notice any difference between black spaghetti and normal spaghetti. No, it didn't taste any different, does it? No, no. Uh, however, uh, the main reason why I picked that was because it included chorizo, and that's, it's my favourite meat of all time. And there was one piece of chorizo in all the spaghetti bolognese. Just one? Just one. Oh it dear. were a nice chorizo, <laughs> but I picked it because of chorizo, so no, it was all right. It was it was good. Was it warm? Well, look, warm. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, 
Tim, tell us your final thoughts on the dining room. Well, Colin, it was a game of two halves. Um, the wine was lovely, Anna the waitress was an absolute delight. The start art was spot on, but then the main, my main, was stone cold when it came. Um, we were waiting a long, long time and I did hear uh, they were ringing a bell in the kitchen to say someone's food was ready for a good five or ten minutes. I think it was probably ours. Uh, so ours was the next food to come out. However, I, I did tell the waitress that my dinner was cold and she knocked it off the bill, which uh, was really generous because I did eat half of it. So um, we tipped her half the value um, of the meal. So it's, it's a tricky one. Part of it was perfect and part of it was rubbish. So, Chatter Gang, that's a dining room for you. Colin, what were your final thoughts? Uh, it were all right, I'll give it that. Um, it was made up by Anna. If you do come to the uh, dining room and you're served by Anna from Poland, you're in for a great treat. Um, so, yeah, she was a lovely girl, wasn't she? She was lovely. However, um, the main course let the start in. The starter was lovely, and it, as you said, Tim, it, it was a game of two halves, but fortunately for me, I wanted more to it, so. Yeah, um, for me, uh, parts of it were perfect, parts of it were just horrible. Couldn't eat, it was so cold, the veg and potatoes were so cold, I couldn't eat them. Um, so, how many stars, Colin? Uh, I'm gonna give it a three. Yeah, I'm gonna split it down the middle as well. Uh, if it had just been the start, it would have been a five. If it had just been the main course, it would have been a one and a half. Yeah. So yeah, I'm going with three, two, but. Is it going to get the chatter guy's stamp of approval? Not on your Nelly. No, not no. for the price that we had to pay. We'd expect it to be spot on, so yeah. not on this occasion. It was quite expensive and we've eaten in a lot at cheaper places in Benidorm and had a lot better yeah, quality of food than that. Yeah. However, don't let that put you off trying it. Uh, it may have come out warmer. <laughs> it might. We do hope you do like the video. If you do, please give us the thumbs up. And if you are new to the channel and don't want to miss out on any of our future videos, please subscribe because it'll cost you. Absolutely not. Thanks for watching Chatter Gang. We'll catch you on the next one. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Night night. Night.